prove that log base b of x is equal to log base a of x divided by log base a of 10, sorry, a of b. Okay, now this is a very useful rule. Uh, I'll explain first with the help of example. Suppose uh, log, suppose if someone is asking you log base 2 of 8, okay, without, I, I can say the answer is 3. Why? Because this, this is nothing but 2 to the power 3 is equal to 8. So this and this are, this is called the log form and this is the exponent form. If someone is asking me log, what is log of so 16 base 2, I can say that is 4 because 2 to the power of 4 is 16. Okay, so let me take one more example. So log base, say, 27 or log base 3 of 27 is 3 because 3 to the power 3 or 3 cube is equal to 27. Okay, now, but some if someone is asking me or someone is asking you log base 2 of 15 is what? Okay, say so is say x. Okay, so of course you can write this in exponent form. So that is 2 to the power x is equal to 15. Now, of course, if you solve this, you can get the value of x. Logically, I know 2 to the power, 2 to the power 3 is 8 and 2 to the power 4 is 16. So this will be very close to 4. So it will be 3.9 something would give me 15 using logic. But if I don't want to solve this and I want to get the exact answer of x without doing any working, I can use this rule. Okay, this rule says that log base, log base 2 of 15 is log of 15 so I can take the base 10 here. Okay, so this, if I want to use on a calculator, so this is same as log base 10 of 15 divided by log base 10 of 15 divided by log base 10 of 2. Okay, let me show you this on a calculator. So this is, you go log 15, which is base 10, divided by log 2. That will give me the answer. Now, how do I know this answer? Because 2 to the power of this should give me 15. 2 to the power, so let me move this slightly. So, oops. 2 to the power, that number. So, if you go 2 raised to the answer, shift answer, would give me 15. Okay. So, okay, so yeah, let me take one more example so to make this quite clear. Suppose log base 3 of, say, 21 is, say, y, uh, is, say, p, okay? So writing this in an exponent form, I know 3 to the power p is 21. So I can make a guess, so 3 to the power, 3 to the power, 3 squared is 9, and 3 to the power 3 is 27. So using my logic, I can say your P should be between 2 and 3. But if I want the exact answer, if I don't want to use, I don't want to solve this, but I want the exact answer, I'll go log, I'm not right basing base 10, so that is same as log 21 divided by log 3. So let me use a calculator. So exit log 21 divided by log 3 will give me the answer. Okay, let me slightly move this. Equal this number 2 point, and this is how I can check 3 raised to this answer would give me 21. Okay. Okay. So now let me prove this. Okay. So let me rewrite the rule. Log base b of x 
is equal to is equal to log base a of x dot all always divide the thus argument first divided by log base a of b okay so let us start like this let log base b of x is equal to m this implies writing this in the exponent form i can say x is equal to b to the power m so let me write this as result one okay right hand side is log base a of x is equal to say p so writing this in the uh, in the exponent form i can say x is equal to a to the power p so this is this is result two okay so what can i write log the second term is log base a of b is equal to q is equal to q so again writing this in exponent form i can say b is equal to a to the power b is equal to a to the power q a to the power q is equal to say so this is result three okay now what can i do i want to write both of them two and three in in terms of a so let me write two again a to the power p is equal to x so if i want a here here the power of x is one i will multiply i want to multiply this by one over p so i have to do the same thing to this power so which implies a is equal to x to the power 1 over p again let me write a to the power q a to the power q that's result 3 a to the power q is equal to b i want to get rid of this q so i'm going to multiply this by 1 over q on this side so to also multiply 1 over q on this side this implies a is equal to a is equal to i need to lift my pen b to the power one over q say so this is result four and this is result five so i want you to look at result four and result five so four says a is equal to this and five says a is equal to this so the left hand side of four and five are equal so i can say therefore from four and five therefore from four and five can i say x to the power one over p is equal to b to the power one over q now if i want to get rid of this one over p what should i do to this so i want to get i want to write this as x is equal to so this is 1 over p times p is equal to is equal to b to the power 1 over q times p okay so i hope you understand whatever you do on one side you can do on the other side okay so yeah so this means x to x is equal to b to the power p over q so this is which result say i'll call this a result six so x is equal to b over p b raised to p over q say this is result six so let's go back to result one what's result one where's result one yeah this is result one in result one we said x is equal to b to the power b so let me write result one again but x is equal to b to the power m this is one so in result six we are saying x is equal to b to the power p over six 
and result 1 we said x is equal to b to the power m therefore from 1 and 6 therefore from 1 and 6 what can we see b to the power m is equal to b to the power p over 6 again bases are same therefore i can say m is nothing but p divided by q what is m okay let us go back this is your m m is log base b of x and this is your p and q okay therefore we can say we know m therefore I can say log base b of x is same as is equal to p. p is log base a of x log base a of x divided by log base a of b.